Well, violated. That's how neighbors feel after someone stole credit cards, cash, and other items from several vehicles this morning. And they have video of the guy doing it, and police are now trying to track him down. Kim Gable brings us the story only on KDKA. And one of the victims in this case did what a lot of folks do these days when they have video that they want to share. She posted it on social media. This is Kim Hot's Facebook page. She uh, put this up this morning. It already has thousands of views, hundreds of reactions and comments. Here's what happened on Miller Avenue near Newcastle early this morning. That gut-wrenching feeling of watching a criminal on your property stealing your belongings. Kim Hot's new surveillance system caught this guy in the act around 6 a.m. Thursday. I feel violated. I mean, who wouldn't feel violated? I don't feel comfortable with somebody like that walking around. Kim says she started shaking when she saw the footage. He's in there rummaging through the car, uh, the console, the glove compartment, everything, and he grabs my purse and he set it by the back tire so he could continue rummaging through the car. He even looks up right into the camera, an image that's now a key piece of evidence for Union Township Police. Kim snapped these photos of the culprit's footprints in the dewy grass. She followed them. And that's when I found the neighbor's wallet on the way back with credit cards all over the yard. That neighbor is Ashley Boyce. We're hardworking people. We, we get up, we go to work, we support our family, we watch out for each other in this neighborhood and to just feel so violated as a community, like just go get a job. Right now, investigators are doing their job, comparing the video to this photo taken last month. The victims think it's the same guy. I'm hoping somebody recognizes him, identifies him, and he gets turned in. It's not right. It's just not right. And one of the most prevalent comments she's getting, and you're probably thinking this too, is why didn't she lock her car door? Well, Kim actually did think she locked it. The battery uh, in her remote actually needs replaced, so she thought her car was locked. Now, detectives here at the Union Township Police Department, they have a copy of all of that video. They want to hear from you if you recognize that man. We're in Lawrence County tonight. Kim Gable, KDKA-TV News.